Okay, perfect. Well, good morning, everyone, and hello. Uh, thank you so much for joining and taking some time out of your busy week, as I'm sure it is, uh, to learn a little bit about Grandstream's um, unified communication solutions. Uh, I prepared a short webinar for you here uh, that we're just going to go through these various solutions, provide a system overview, and look at some uh, highlighted case studies that do a pretty good job of showing information about them and some of the advantages as well of the various products in our portfolio. For those who do not know me, my name is Brian Van Meter. I'm a marketing manager here at Grandstream Networks. But with no further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Uh, if you're watching this via IP video talk right now, by the way, uh, you do have that chat feature. Feel free to use it to talk amongst each other. Uh, but if you have any questions, there is at the lower hand of your portal, a uh, little Q&A feature. Please go ahead and utilize that, and that's where I'll answer questions from. And if you're watching this through either YouTube or uh, Facebook Live, uh, please feel free to just add any questions in the comments as well, and I will answer them there. Let me go ahead and pull up our presentation for today. Okay. All right, can someone just give me a quick conf confirmation in the chat? You should be able to see my presentation now. Okay, yes, awesome. Thank you, guys. Appreciate that. Okay, great. Well, yeah, so thank you so much for joining. Uh, we're going to be going over a brief introduction to Grandstream's Unified Communication Solutions. So what we have pre prepared today, we'll be talking about the benefits of Grandstream's Unified Communications and doing a quick little solution overview. A product portfolio introduction, we're not going to be taking any deep dives really, but we will be sort of covering the various product portfolios that we have that sort of complement all into a total UC solution that you as installers or resellers would be able to leverage. Uh, we're definitely going to cover UCM 6300 ecosystem, which for those who may not be super familiar with Grandstream, we really recently released it. Uh, it's our new UC solution that we have out on the market. It has a great real amount of features uh, and really exciting to talk about. We'll be then just kind of dipping into a case study overview and just kind of examining some of those and their deployment examples. And then we'll just have a short Q&A session at the end, all in all, about a 30-minute webinar here today. Okay, so let's uh, quick get going. For those who may not be super familiar with Grandstream, uh, we were founded in 2002 in Boston. We have over 600 employees in 14 countries, and more than 100 direct distributors and thousands of authorized resellers all around the globe. Uh, we have a global presence with offices in the United States, Venezuela, Morocco, China, Malaysia. We actually have four research and development centers when it comes to all of our devices. Uh, so this is Dallas, Los Angeles, Shenzhen, Guangzhou. Okay, and, you know, if you're not too familiar with our history, we have a portfolio of just constant innovation. We started off with IP telephony back in 2002, pivoted a little bit more into video IP phones, then into IP BBX solutions, which is what we may be kind of the most well known for, along with our IP telephony solutions. Then after that, we dab a little bit into video conferencing, and our most recent portfolio addition has been our networking solution, our Wi-Fi access point solutions. But we're here today to talk about our unified communications portfolio. So our unified communications portfolio uh, it was built with a full range of IP endpoints, video conferencing solutions, and of course our award-winning IP BBXs. We have years of innovation all kind of funneled into delivering a state-of-the-art portfolio with this solution. But the main thing that we aimed is really through Grandstream, uh, your clients, your businesses can get the ability to integrate a collection of real-time and non-real-time systems. So products, you know, any services, devices, all the optimized their operations 
and their cohesion. So it's all focused on how your clients can better work together and create a better solution for them. So it's about integrating voice, data, video, and mobility applications. Uh, gaining a significant benefits, uh, including increased productivity and efficiency. It's, of course, really important. It's one of the core reasons why we deploy UC. And, of course, it gives users a better decision-making skills, greater flexibility, improved workplace collaboration, and improved professional appearance and customer service. You know, end of the day, when you know, we're deploying these unified communications for our clients, so you guys as installers or resellers, you know, we're trying to make solutions that work best for them, that really excel their businesses as well. So some of the benefits to uh, kind of look at when it comes to RUC uh, over maybe some other options. Um, you know, we have an extensive array of communication project products and applications all under one brand, and they are all integrated together uh, from, you know, voice IP phones to our video IP phones, video conferencing, and cloud conferencing, uh, mobility from our Grandstream Wave application, which we'll cover a little bit later, uh, along with our cordless IP phones. You know, we're one of the only providers on the market as well that offer a Wi-Fi cordless IP phone. Our uh, surveillance solutions, of course, and data, all of these things come together and integrate together uh, to provide a very smart, intelligent, and productive solution. Uh, we have an expanded voice communication options with custom voice features, so everything from your standard IVR to call queue, call recording, call routing, uh, call conferencing features, et cetera, uh, all, you know, all built into the UCM IPBBX series and all fully customized so any deployment can be tailor-made. And of course, our web interface and cloud provisioning uh, provides you guys, installers, resellers, IT teams, uh, with powerful tools to easily manage deployments. Uh, this is especially true uh, of our GDMS, Grandstream Device Management System, it's our cloud-based provisioning system, which I'll be talking about a little bit later. And then uh, we have affordable solutions with a wide feature set. So this really aims to help empower small to medium businesses with innovative te technology. You know, one of our mission statements at Grand Stream is that we believe in connecting the world. And a big portion of that is, you know, we really do believe small to medium businesses deserve to have that sort of high-end tech, high-end features um, that may not be obtainable to them through other solutions. And last but not least, our solutions add mobile support for remote workers, uh, employees able to access and share information internally and externally uh, to be more productive and, of course, more competitive. Um, you know, definitely remote work is something that got absolutely catapulted, excuse me, catapulted by the COVID-19 pandemic. And our solutions are something uh, that sort of for this workplace of the future can help bridge all participating parties together very easily. Okay, so just to sort of give a quick overview of some of our solutions that we have there out on the market. Uh, our IP phones, of course, is one of our bread and butter. Um, you know, basically the key selling point here is that we have a SIP device for absolutely any user. Um, so we have a wide variety of innovative IP terminals uh, to suit any deployment. Uh, so we have a wide portfolio of varying price points and features from our GXP series uh, to our G newer GRP series of carrier-grade phones. Cordless IP phones as well with both, uh, you know, like I was saying earlier, Wi-Fi and DEX solutions. And it all has, of course, a focus on call handling productivity. Our IP video phones, which are innovative and high-end collaboration. Uh, but these devices are really fantastic because, of course, they provide easy and simple desktop collaboration and desktop video conferencing. But they're also built in with the Android operating system, allowing a lot of great flexibility uh, in integrated web features uh, with the device itself. It really is as if a video communications IP endpoint got integrated with the functionality of the tablet. Business conferencing solutions, which offers collaboration solutions for companies of any size. 
Uh, so, you know, of course, we have our standard room-based video conferencing, but we also have cloud conferencing as well through our IP Video Talk app. But it brings the capabilities and benefits, uh, power and flexible devices to businesses of any size. We have everything from low-end to high-end video conferencing options, all with a suite of features to help push the benefits that video conferencing can bring to any deployment. Our more recent GUV series, a uh, set of personal collaboration devices. Uh, this is a newer portfolio that we've recently added uh, to our devices. So this is our headsets and also webcams. But these bring a variety of powerful audio and video solutions that enhance remote communication and remote collaboration, uh, whether it's remote offices, geographic, geographically dispersed offices, individuals who are working from home or working out of a home office. These devices really help bring an essence of uh, communication, collaboration, and keep individuals productive as well, along with just connected with each other or you know, their customers. It's designed to give HD communication experience uh, with all day comfort. So like I said, remote workers, students, teachers, healthcare professionals, uh, contact centers, and of course more. We do have our SIP intercoms uh, and speakers, paging devices, Your pretty standard uh, devices that you would expect when it comes to public address and two-way intercom solutions. But these can be really leveraged and utilized for whether it's schools, offices, uh, apartment complex, hotels, etc. And of course, uh, last but not least, our UCM series of IPBBXs. Uh, sort of the anchor to our unified communication solutions, enterprise-grade features, powerful communication. Uh, so the UCM series is all about providing high-end unified communication solutions uh, with a complete ecosystem of mobility, security, video, collaboration tools, everything all under one brand and easily connected and integrated together to provide smarter solutions for your customers. Device management as well, for those who may not be too familiar with it, uh, we do have gr uh, grant stream device management uh, solutions. So essentially, excuse me, system, like I was saying earlier, uh, completely just manage entire portfolio solutions uh, and your all of your deployments entirely from the cloud. All right, uh, so definitely, you know, if we're talking grand stream unified communications, uh, we really need to touch on the UCM 6300 series, uh, our newest IPBBX and complete ecosystem, as we like to refer to it, um, of a solution. And if you just give me one second, I'm just going to take a quick sip of water before we keep going. All right. So the UCM 6300 series uh, is designed to provide high-end unified communication solutions, okay, all packed within an ecosystem, of mobility, security, video, and collaboration tools. Before we dive too much into the ecosystem, it's just important to talk a little bit more about the appliance. Uh, but essentially, the UCM 6300 series, the IPPBX, it provides a platform that unifies all of the business communication tools on one centralized network. So it brings together the voice, video, so calling conferences and surveillance, uh, remote working, mobility, web meetings, data and, and analytics, facility access and intercoms, and more. Everything all on just one device. And this includes being able to have it reach outside of its own network. So UCM 6300 series um, supports up to 3,000 users. Uh, there's four various models within this series, but the amount of users that you can have on one device can definitely get staggering. But it actually has built-in web meetings and video conferencing solution. It allows employees to connect either from a desktop mobile phone, GB series device, and IP phones. So those web meetings and video conference uh, solutions can all be built into the IP BBX itself. Uh, so it's fully compatible with the UCM 6300 ecosystem, which we'll be getting into for a moment. And for you installers, uh, you know, resellers, 
IT teams. Uh, this is completely managed entirely from the cloud. So cloud setup and management through GDMS. Completely possible to create turnkey solutions entirely just via MAC address, setting up templates and setting out these devices. So you don't have to technically be on site at all times, every time you want to change anything. So the UCM 6300 ecosystem, let's take a quick look kind of zoom out away from the UCM 6300 itself and kind of think about the UCM ecosystem. Uh, so it's all about mobilizing your business. So a modern unified communications deployment uh, really requires remote work. That's, that's just a huge thing. It's a fact of the matter. Uh, needs ways that staff can be mobilized and still interconnected. So remote staff, geographically separated offices. You know, the modern office isn't just a bunch of cubicles anymore. Uh, we're starting to branch out more and more. And therefore, you know, we really got to leverage those tools to make sure communication and collaboration is just the same as it used to be. So with the UCM 6300 ecosystem, you get all the tools you need to mobilize your business without really any complications, headaches, uh, or road bumps, really. Uh, it gives you the best in a class of a hybrid solution to keep remote workers, devices, and branches all connected to your network. So basically how it does this is that it provides the reliability and the control of the on-premise solution, so the UCM 6300 series, uh, and with the power and flexibility of cloud solutions. Uh, this is through GDMS and UCM Remote Connect, which we'll be touched on in a second. It's all about pairing together that customizability and control with remote access and flexibility. All right, so the three kind of major parts of this unified communication solution with the UCM 6300 ecosystem, like I said, is GDMS, which is for your cloud-based management for not only UCMs that we have here, uh, but also all of your grand stream devices, uh, you know, our GRP series, um, you know, many of our IAP phones, IP video phones, et cetera. Uh, UCM Remote Connect uh, provides a seamless connection between remote extensions, so Remote Connect actually provides uh, that firewall traversal from remote offices and workers and maybe branch offices to the centralized network, so you don't really have to set up any kind of complicated VPN setups or anything like that. Uh, you already have that NAT firewall traversal built into Remote Connect as a service. And of course, Grandstream Wave. Uh, collaboration from any device. Uh, it's our soft phone that can be utilized, whether it's from a desktop, a smart device. Right. So real quick, a look at GDMS, just because I've been talking about it a lot here. Um, so GDMS, Grand Stream Device Management System, zero touch cloud provisioning and management, provides easy to use enterprise tools uh, to manage Grandstream products. So it's all about being before, during, and after de de the deployment, making your lives as installers, resellers, IT teams a lot easier when it comes to managing your solutions as well. But it provides centralized interface to provision, configure, monitor, and troubleshoot. Uh, but configuration, manage, monitoring of devices, accounts, firmwares can all be done from GDMS, all from the cloud, all from your workstation, your laptop. Uh, Real-time network monitoring and analytical system reports, just so you can always take a look at your network, make sure everything is functioning the way it should. But you can actually also manage batches of devices uh, by deployment sites, device groups, modeling within those sites, all through GDMS. So whether you want to push firmware templates, or excuse me, firmware updates, completely update configuration settings, maybe add new devices to a deployment, and those can and then configure and provision them to that deployment. Uh, this can all be done via Grandstream Device Management System. You technically maybe wouldn't even have to go on site uh, as long as there's someone there who could physically set up the phones for you. Uh, but it also features some intelligent alarms, troubleshooting, and diagnostics reports. Uh, so this helps you all essentially know when there's a problem before 
maybe your customer or your client will even know there's a problem and get it fixed. And of course, automated firmware updates, device resets, and use logs can all be pushed through GMS as well. All right, so a quick look at UCM ecosystem, uh, especially important to look at it if we're kind of trying to analyze it as this great UC solution. Uh, so remote users, for example, could be connected through the internet. Uh, so, you know, third-party apps, so if individuals are using Wave, Zoom, Teams, Meet, uh, et cetera, would be able to leverage the GUV solutions. Uh, so whether that's the webcams or the headsets, uh, IP Video Talk, which is our cloud conferencing, uh, could then also be a video conferencing service. Uh, could also be leveraged to talk within clients on premise or customers. And of course, through GDMS and Remote Connect, these remote users are all then connected to the local network. So, of course, you have your corporate firewall, uh, but Remote Connect provides that natural that firewall traversal. So remote users with desktop IP phones or other devices can easily be included into sort of the deployment on your client premises, where your IP PBX is, your IP phones, your cordless IP phones, your video conferencing solution. And one good thing to mention about GDMS as well is that GDMS itself is completely free. Um, you know, it's definitely important to mention so you all the management of your devices can be done entirely free. It's just essentially a great cloud tool that we want to provide to our installers, resellers, and IT teams, just to sort of empower them, give them the ability to easily manage their solutions. Uh, then UCM Remote Connect, just we're touching on it really quick as well, uh, but it allows businesses, like I was saying earlier, to build a secure collaboration solution for your remote workers. So it offers a companion cloud service for the UCM 6300 series, but it provides an always-on automatic NAT firewall traversal. So this ensures a connection for these remote users. Uh, this obviously provides a huge advantage to you guys as the installers, IT teams, et cetera. You know, you don't have to set up those VPNs. You don't have to have any kind of complicated uh, consultation with someone that may be remote, having them install something on their computer or having them install something. Um, you know, it's, it's not needed. Uh, the automated NAT firewall traversal can be completely configured by you through UCM Remote Connect. All you really need is the MAC address of the uh, IP phone you're sending and of the devices that need to then be traversed into the local network where the IPPX is housed. Uh, so when it comes to unified communication solution-wise, you know, this definitely provides that sort of almost hosting advantage that you have with the cloud solution while still being able to have the full custom ability of a on-site or on-premise device. So we're getting the best of both worlds. But like I was saying, zero touch out of box platform really allows remote users and devices to reach the UCM 6300 from outside of a corporate or business network. Then last but not least, there's our Wave app, which is important to touch on. Uh, it's all about connecting from anywhere at any time. Uh, so Wave is a mobile and also web. Um, we also just recently released a desktop app as well uh, that provides remote voice and video collaboration tools for businesses uh, that use the UCM 6300 series. But it's ideal for remote workers uh, or even workers who are just simply working straight out of their desktop but it's an easy to use platform that can join, schedule, hold me meetings, video conferences, calls, conferences from anywhere. And all these video conferences, these meetings are hosted on the IPBBX itself. Uh, so Wave is a great tool for those who are looking to utilize soft phone applications, maybe over traditional IP phones. And once again, this is a solution that's just entirely free, just a great tool that we wanted that sort of improves your deployments. Just a little bit of extra details here on Wave. All right, I just noticed the time. I'm going a little slow here, so I'll try and speed this up so I can answer any questions that you guys may have. Uh, so now we are on our uh, unified communications case studies. 
Um, so we're going to be covering three real quick today, uh, Voice Connect, Accor Hotels, and Majestic Resorts. So Accor Hotels, uh, it's a French multinational company. It owns and manages franchises, uh, over 30 different brands of hotels, resorts, and vacation properties. They want to upgrade their outdated legacy systems in most of their hotels and need a solution for both staff and guests. Uh, they did choose Grand Stream for this, of course, uh, choosing our IP phones, audio conferencing devices, our UCM IP BBX, our HA100, uh, which is our high av availability device. But for this solution, front desk and concierge were upgraded with their ability to handle high volume calls uh, by utilizing our high end GXPIP phones. They had business centers and hotel lobby amenities, which were upgraded with the GAC2500 audio conferencing device and GXPIP phones. This was mainly aimed to improve guest experience in the way business users would interact on the hotel grounds. And administrative and office staff were made more productive with GXV video phones and the Grandstream Wave application. This gave them the availability to host on-the-fly video conferences and web meetings just to make the most of their time together and collaborate as efficiently as possible. Uh, guests were provided with basic GXPIP phones. And a main and backup 6510 and HA100 create a fully redundant communications network. So Voice Connects. Uh, Voice Connects was designed by, uh, is, excuse me, designs redundant distributed communication networks for education industry throughout the state of Missouri. Uh, school districts there had older discontinued VoIP IPPX systems, uh, but they chose Grandstream to make a modern, future-proof, scalable, and affordable solution. Uh, so Voice Connects uh, is actually an installer, uh, but has deployed over uh, 12 districts and counting down in Missouri. I think it's actually much more than 12 since we actually made this case study. But the solution that they made, the unified communication solution they made, is redundant, easy to use, feature loaded uh, network that can be scaled with the UCM series of IPBXs. So the UCMs were, uh, <laughs> that's just saw the chat. Hello, <laughs> here's your case study. Um, so UCMs uh, were deployed in a uh, network arrangement in which each district had a central IPBX and each school within the district had an additional IPBX. Uh, high-end GXPIP phones for endpoints were chosen for their high-end features and high-volume capabilities. Uh, conference capabilities were where they were necessary were added with the GAC2500 series. And video conferencing capabilities and multimedia tools help uh, enhance the administration staff's productivity with the GXV IP video phones. Then for schools where facility security was uh, needed, the GDS3710 was able to be leveraged for that. All right, last but not least, guys, then we'll jump to the Q&A, uh, Majestic Resorts. Uh, so the Majestic Group uh, required a communications network that would allow staff to easily collaborate and fit guest rooms and public spaces. Uh, they have a series of resorts uh, throughout the world. Uh, one of the most important aspects of this deployment was the ability for the uni unified communication solution to be scalable. So Grandstream was chosen because of uh, an integrated one brand solution along with the simplicity of administration and management of the system. So through Grandstream, they were able to create an agile uh, and feature rich solution that integrated with third party PMS systems and provide staff and guests with an effective way to communicate. So we had 6510s, IPVXs and HA100s create the core of the deployment. Uh, so providing a high availability, availability setup that connected over a thousand extensions, high end GXPIP phones integrated with the hotel PMS systems, which is a great benefit for both guests and staff. And hotel execs were given the GX, GXVIP video phones, allowing them to easily participate in video conferences with other hotels, departments, regional offices. And a really important piece of this solution with security as well were the GDS 3710 facility access devices were installed in various entrances of the hotel, which could be open 
via deployed Grandstream IP phones. All right, everyone. Uh, so I went a little bit over there on time. That was my bad. Uh, <laughs> I'll talk a little bit faster next time. Um, but thank you so much. Uh, we're going to go ahead and just move on to the Q&A session uh, real quick. Uh, currently, I only saw there was one or two questions, um, which I can get to. But if you have any, please feel free to drop it in the Q&A tool uh, or you know, even in the chat. The chat didn't get too hectic, luckily, this time. Just bring my screen back up here. OK. All right. Uh, so yeah, one question I saw there, uh, is there a charge for GDMS? Um, there is no charges for GDMS. Like I said earlier, uh, it's just a really convenient and great tool we wanted to make for you guys being our installers, our resellers, um, you know, and IT teams to be able to uh, have a very competitive way uh, to manage your Grandstream solutions. Um, it's a really great advantage uh, when it comes to managing your devices. Not all of our devices are on. Uh, can be managed through it. So I, I would definitely recommend uh, logging in, taking a look at the portal, kind of learning it a bit. Uh, it's, it's really great. Um, so yeah, th th this is a fair question. Compelling reasons to upgrade from the UCM 6200 series to the 6300 series. Um, you know, so it's worth saying we're just, we will be supporting the 6200 series. I know some people have asked a lot of questions about that. Um, it is still going to be completely, um, you know, supported for the near future. Um, but when it comes to upgrading, uh, you know, pretty much the UCM 6300 series has a leg up on the 6200 series just because of the ecosystem solution, right? So UCM 6300 series can be managed from the cloud. It has a NAT firewall traversal. Uh, also, just if we're talking about the devices itself, just a straight one-to-one -one comparison, has a little bit more bang for your buck when it comes to the amount you're paying uh, with the processing power that you're getting. Uh, so the amount of seats that you can have, extensions, concurrent calls, um, you know, definitely has some advantages there. Um, where someone actually mentioned this, George, you mentioned this in the um, in the chat. We're actually very shortly here also going to be releasing our UCM 6300 audio series, um, which is essentially an audio only device uh, that we are bringing to the market as well. Uh, so that that one is for deployments. When you may want to still choose the 6200 series, so we were kind of running into situations where eh, people didn't want to pay. A little bit, you know, the, the affordability was a little more important, so they kept going with the 6200 series, um, you know, which, which kind of stinks because then you're, you're losing out on some of the benefits of the ecosystem. Um, so, you know, we also have the UCM 6300 audio series coming out, which is focused on an audio only solution and audio only benefits. Um, so it sort of cuts out some of the video conferencing stuff with the UCM 6300 series is the normal one, um, but would be a great alternative to the 6200 series as well. Um, you know, there's just a lot of benefits with the 6300 series um, that, you know, could be taken advantage of uh, should an upgrade be necessary or needed. You know, obviously, I'm not sitting here telling you to go through all your deployments and change everything, but um, there are some distinct advantages that are worth considering, uh, probably with your clients. Yeah, so this is a good question. Currently, there's no way you can't take a backup with the 6200 uh, to the 6300 without help desk support. Um, I'll take a look into it. I, I believe we may be working on something, but I don't want to make any guarantees without checking in with uh, my development team on that. Uh, so I'll follow up in the follow-up email uh, that I send out a little bit after uh, that should hopefully have some information on that. This Friday, though, hopefully they'll be quick to respond to me. Uh, OK. Yeah, and if not, I'll, I'll just reach out to you individually as well. So yeah, does uh, GDMS work only with the UCM 6300 or with all UCM models? It only works uh, with the UCM 6300 uh, series. Yeah, really good question as well. 
Um, so HA device hardware arrived for the UCM 6300 series. Um, we actually have firmware in the works. Um, so the UCM 6300 series has a heartbeat port. Um, so we actually have firmware coming. Uh, I actually asked about this pretty recently on a different subject, uh, but was told roughly late June. So, you know, that's an approximate date uh, where essentially you'd be able to connect two of those UCM 6300 series together. And it's, a, uh, it's an IP-based high availability solution. Uh, so basically, they would have share the same configurations, both UCMs. They'd be connected through a heartbeat port. One UCM would be the primary UCM. The other one would be the sort of redundant one. Whenever the primary UCM would go down, all calls, settings, et cetera, would be then pushed over uh, to the secondary UCM, which would jump in, um, providing you with a high availability solution. Uh, but that's actually going to be through a firmware update, and it won't require any additional hardware to actually work. Uh, that's a good question. I'm, I am not too sure if it'll function uh, over VPN2, so I, I'll, I'll need to check in with that. Um, that's not this a little bit over my technical knowledge, unfortunately. All right. Okay, guys. So I think that's all the questions. We're about 11 minutes over. So thank you so much for taking the extra time out of your days. Uh, but once again, I hope you enjoyed learning about our unified communication solutions here with GrantStream. Uh, I will be emailing out the slides and presentation. But take care. Uh, have yourself a great rest of your Friday and a great weekend, everyone. Bye-bye.